What is up, everybody? Welcome to a brand new episode of Manager Career Mode. If you guys missed out on that last episode, well, you know what to do. And just like that, the transfer deadline has come and gone. So now we can get to work. Now that I have my squad that I want, it is time to get to work trying to get those results. We have big aspirations this season. So now for me, the fun begins. Let's do it. Two massive games. So like always, sit back, relax. Let's do this. All right, so moving into our first game, we play Huddersfield at home, and this is our first game at home. So I expect a massive crowd. I expect everybody to show up just in a large amount of just people and just going insane for their hammers, man. I really do expect a massive crowd, you know, and I do believe that that 12th man is key, and that is up to the fans. So I do expect a massive, massive participation from the crowd. So anyways, big, big game. We have to go out. We have to get it our first game at home we can't screw this up let's do it all right it's our first game at home boys we expect really good response from our just from our crowd man just from our supporters it is our first game so i expect nothing but crazy chaos and i expect and just intimidate huddersfield i really do we need to go out there and we need to do our part as well but i do expect a big part uh being played by the crowd let's go come on we have a lot to make up, so we got the players that we wanted, so it's all up to us now. Let's go. Big head. Oh. Let's go. Come on. Oh, that is a terrible shot. Are you kidding me? Uh-oh, here we go. Oh, what a save, Joe Hart. Oh, there you have it. Pretty frustrating half, boys. Pretty pretty frustrating. We started off really well, passing the ball, creating some decent opportunities. But other than that, that was it. That was the first 10 minutes after that. It just seems like Huddersfield stepped it up, put it up, put the pressure on us, started creating a little better opportunities. That is not what I want. Not in our first game at home. So we need to change it up. We need to change it up, be a little bit more aggressive, and start taking control of the ball and this damn game. Too easy. Ooh. Wow. No, oh, no. He's injured. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Terrible. That is absolutely terrible. Maybe this is what we need. Maybe that's what we need to kind of ignite here. Oh, he's gone. Please. Oh my god, that's our first real attack. Let's go, come on. Wow, what a save. Oh, here we go. Ooh, let's go. That was beautiful. That's what we needed. Let's go. Come on, baby. We still got time. That was a beautiful through ball. I think that was by Coyote. I think. I got to see the replay. Yes. Dude, look at that. It's crazy. There we go. Oh, he's gone again. What? Oh, woo! Dude, great finishing. Look at that. <laughs> oh my God, that was beautiful. Beautiful. Wow, I don't even, what, what are they doing? They're just like locked up, look at this, just turns. 
I think it's that turn where he turns with his right and then just hits it with his left foot crossbody. Oh yeah, that just had power all over it. That was a really, really good, just strong shot. Let's go, come on, that's what we need. That's what I'm talking about, let's go. Javier El Chicharito Hernandez, let's go. Let's go. Oh, wow. What a save. Wow. Rep. Oh, I'm going to hit take this. No, I'm not. No, I'm going to play catch up. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. I didn't mean to do it. I'm sorry. Oh, thank God. Thank God, I'll take that. That's a smart foul. That could have been red. What do you guys think? Shit, that was terrible. Win that, yes. Oh, let's go. That's what we want. Woo! I was scared, I'm not gonna lie. As soon as we concede it, I'm like, no, 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 not what we need and not, that is not what we deserve. But, you know, big credit to the boys, man. I am so happy that they were able to turn it around. Javier Hernandez, literally, man, just uh, man of the match. Absolutely two goals. Yeah, this guy is a striker and he is a goal poacher. He is our guy. This is the guy that we're going to rely on him. And Lorenzo Insigne are the guys that we're going to need uh, to step up big if this team is going to have any success this season. Oh, let's go. Come on, Chicharito. We need you. We need a few more goals. He was just amazing last game. Getting two goals, getting the winner. He was just a huge part in our victory. So now we need to do it again. Let's go at the Hawthorns, man. Let's go. West Brom. West Brom is a really, really tough team. For some reason, when they play at home, I've always seen them to be really, really tough. They elevate their game. You know, it seems like they're really proud of just playing at home, and they do not like to get punked around by anybody. So, uh, right now we are in sixth place. I ran a victory could push us into the top four. That would be nice. That would be really, really nice. Oh, what a save. Great save, Joe Hart. Good ball. Oh! Oof. Wow. <laughs> B-E-A. Beautiful. Man, that was just great. That was just pure pace. Look at that. Burn. Burn. And look at this. Just first post. Ben Foster, one of my favorite goalkeepers too. So underrated. He just got beat really, really easy. Let's go. Come on. What we needed. Let's go. This guy is awesome, dude. I'm, I cannot believe he decided to come to West Ham. I'm happy. But he is a superstar in the making, at least in my opinion. He's just, just phenomenal. <sighs> Trying to bust a Coutinho. Oh, wow. That was not... That was not bad at all. It was dipping just a little bit too high. Just go good half, boys. That's what I'm talking about. It's been it's been a close half. I mean, I th I think we've we've been the better team. We deserve to be up top, but I think it's been a lot closer than we would like it to be. They've they've had the ball, created a little bit of opportunities. Joe Hart Joe Hart's made one or two decent saves, but again, we are playing away, and like I said before the match. West Brom at home for some reason tend to just really step it up and elevate their game. So we just need, we need to keep doing our thing and hopefully we can just hold them and just maintain this lead and maybe hopefully get another goal. Be there. Oh! <laughs> no way that's what a poacher does man. Just gets the ball into the back of the net. Doesn't matter how doesn't matter if it's, you know, it's not the best looking goal, but it's a goal no matter what. And we'll take this. Look at this. Just takes his time and just. <laughs> That's a total Chicharito goal right there. Look at this. 
<laughs> it looks like he just flicks it with the tip of his boot. Wow. Well, that's 2 0. I'll take that. Tony Pulis, man. I love him. I love him. I really do. I respect him because he's one of the only managers that still goes old school, goes with the tracksuit and the cap. Just class, man. Pure class. And the fact is, you know, a lot of people do respect them. I mean, I'm talking about like your bigger managers, you know, like your Mourinho's, you know, your your Arsene Wenger. Uh, I even heard that he's really, really good friends with Carlos Ancelotti, who got sacked. Tell me that's not some shit. But anyways, what I'm trying to say is that even though he's not like, you know, your A-class manager and he's not at a big team, he's well respected. Ooh, Hector Herrera. I needed him to score that. That would have been awesome. Clear that. What? Are you kidding me? Oh, wow. I'm just going to stay quiet because I do not want to get booked. <laughs> that is retarded. Here we go. Come on. Ah. Oh, I knew it, man. Wow. That is just a bunch of BS. Ref just gave him that. Gave him that. Oh, now they're back in it. Now we have a game. You got to see this out, boys. Let's go. Come on. Oh, my God. That's it. Oh, let's go. Come on. Big win away at West Brom. Oh, my God. That was a really, really close game. Again, like I said before, for some reason, every time I play West Brom, whether it be in a friendly uh, goalkeeper career mode or manager career mode, they really give me a hard time. And it's one of those games that I hope I'm always up for, but I'm at the same time, I'm really, really nervous because they just make it really, really hard. And this goes to show that, again, they're just a force, man, at home. For some reason, they just pick themselves up for, for, the, for these big games. So anyways, massive win at home. Uh, or I'm sorry, massive win away at West Brom. We'll take that. That's another three points. So, anyways, guys. Anyways, guys, that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please, can we get 20, maybe some even 30 likes, boys? If we can do that, I will get you guys another game just like that, or another episode better said. But anyways, boys, that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please let me know in the comments what what you like, what you don't like, what you want to see in this series or in this, you know, just. In manager career mode again it, I'm really new to this but at the same time I'm really excited really up for the challenge of making West Ham that much better so anyways boys with your help we're gonna do it so anyways I am out I will see you in the next one later